Yoshihiro Togashi, we hope you're watching, because your babies are about to duke it out. All this seems like a pretty major crisis for mankind. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and in today's anime duel, we're pitting Hunter x Hunter's Gone Freaks against Yu Yu Hakusho's Yusuke Urameshi. So sorry you caught me on such a bad day. It makes me a real jerk. It's Hunter vs. Spirit Detective in this contest, and we're looking at each character's strengths and weaknesses. So, our love towards them is out the window. It's all about the numbers. Fine! Let's go now! I'm gonna follow up on my fingers around his throat idea! You needn't hurry. Take the time to hear our words first. Round 1. Strength and Endurance. <laughs> Shame on the contender that underestimates either of these two based on their stature. Both fighters pack a hell of a wallop behind their fist and have easily taken down foes several times their size. Gon's control over his Nen ability accelerates his natural strength capacity to superhuman levels, allowing the half-pint novice hunter to bulldoze through opponents. <sighs> on the other hand, years of delinquent brawls have allowed Yusuke to fall into the same boat, relying on his brute strength to win his battles. While it may be important to reference Yusuke's aptitude in holding his own against lower class demons, in the infancy of his spirit detective career, his mastery of spirit energy puts him on the same tier as S class demons. So that takes grit, folks. Winner, Yusuke. <laughs> Round 2, Versatility. I think there's something wrong with the machine. Here, I'll check it out for you. You don't gain access to the Hunters Association without having a bit more than just a few skills up your sleeve. As the son of renowned hunter Ging Freaks, it seems pretty apparent that Gon's inherited his knack for survival. Just take a look at some of his close calls. Whether it's his heightened senses or his resourcefulness, Gon frequently escapes certain death and successfully protects his allies when in danger. In hunting, versatility is the name of the game, and Gon embodies it. While it's not really fair to say Yusuke doesn't embody this same skill, he is known to have the guns blazing mentality when it comes to battle, more often relying on his brawn to guide him to victory rather than his extensive resources. What exactly would you have done if the spirit gun hadn't bounced off the mirror? Get chopped into pieces, I guess. <laughs> Ironically, analyzing and deduction has never really been a strong suit for the spirit detective, leaving him at wit's end against opponents with a bit more range than your average street thug. Don't you say it's pointless? <laughs> Sorry, Yusuke, but bare knuckles and sheer luck will only get you so far. Winner, gone. Have you ever not known about something that seemed obvious to everybody else? That happens to us all, I think. Round 3, Allies. Nah, Kimikutsu. Now let's talk squad goals. Have you ever seen a finer set of hunters before? If there's one thing you can count on, it's that this gang will always have each other's backs when in a pinch. Gon's closest allies, Killua, Kurapika, and Leorio, were all met during the hunter exam. However, the only one Gon shares a brotherly bond with is Killua. They're all an incredibly well-rounded team, but the only problem is they seldom bump into each other, thanks to their own personal goals and vendettas. <laughs> Yusuke's band of allies, most commonly known as Team Urameshi, is comprised of Kurapara, Kurama, and Hiei. While initially being rivals with Kurubara and encountering both Kurama and Hiei as adversaries, the camaraderie between the four eventually became one that shouldn't be reckoned with. And I suppose you think it'd be noble if we all died as a team. That's right. Yusuke is also lucky enough to have the ruler of the spirit world in his corner, Koenma, as well as the advice of his aide, Botan. You should get a dictionary. Don't you think Yusuke needs to know that? Well, it's not like he's using it. Friendship is the lifeblood of anime, but strong allies in the war against the demon and living world are priceless. Winner, Yusuke. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> we did it! Huh? Yeah. Why don't you quit hugging me, you weirdo? You're the one hugging. I was trying to squeeze you to death. <laughs> Round four, determination. 
<laughs> These two certainly aren't the type to sit back and let things be. <laughs> A part of the reason Gon wins over friends so easily is that people are naturally drawn to his willpower. No matter how formidable his obstacle or opponent, Gon refuses to back down to anything and will often have to be knocked unconscious to involuntarily throw in the towel. What? Nobody's gonna stop this tough little cookie, not even when his hands are blown off. Yusuke's brash and assertive behavior allows him to share the same resolve when it comes to ones he cares about, but he will also have the common sense to determine when he's outmatched. In spite of the badass persona Yusuke normally evokes, he fears for his life just as much as he fears for the lives of his closest friends. Stupid Yusuke! You got so scared around him you couldn't even friggin' move! You idiot! In the moments he gets stuck inside his own head, a little external motivation is usually enough to snap him out of it. You rose to the challenge. It seems you haven't lost your spirit power, you just needed a kick in the ass. That's a wise trait, but in this round, heart wins over brains. Winner, gone. Close up! Come! Round 5. Weapons, Powers, and Equipment You might be thinking that this one would come down to the Spirit Gun and the Judge Enkin, but you fool! You haven't even seen their final forms yet. If you haven't been able to tell, there's a lot more that meets the eye when it comes to these two young protagonists. <sighs> Gon, for instance, derives his power from Nen, in which he holds an enhancer focus. In Gon's most heightened stage, he has the ability to transform into an adult version of himself that elevates his strength and speed to superhuman levels. Yusuke shares a similar ability. However, his transformation originates from his ancestor, Ryzen, believed to be the most powerful demon that ever lived. Hey, what's happened to him now? I mean, is that really even him? When his form is awoken, Yusuke is infused with the power of the Mazuko Demon, allowing his already unearthly powers to become vastly magnified. Even in Gon's most determined condition, it's not likely he'd be able to contend with a being with planet-destroying power in his index finger. Winner, Yusuke. Well, this case is open and shut, with the demon descendant spirit detective taking the win with a score of 3 to 2. Your winner, Yusuke Urameshi. Sorry, Gon. <laughs> well, lucky me, I won! Do you agree with our outcome? <laughs> Which anime characters would you like to see fight next? For more awesome videos published every day, be sure to subscribe to watchmojo.com.